Hello everyone. In this lecture, we will discuss about the organ equation. Organ equation. The organ equation. The organ equation is about the chemical reaction in fake bed reactor. Uh, as we have already discussed about the fake bed reactor, uh, in this lecture we will discuss about the organ equation. Suppose uh, when gas passes through a, a solid particle in a fake bed, then the gas molecule will react with the solid particle which may be catalyst or adsorbent and the reactant will convert it into product. So when suppose this is a fake bed reactor suppose suppose this is a fake bed reactor in which there is some particle suppose this is a fake bed reactor in which gas passes through the fake bed reactor the gas passes through the reactor so this is the gas or the reactant reactant suppose the reactant is denoted by a the reactant passes through the fake bed reactor and the product and the product is produced which is suppose it is b the a is converted into b with the help of these catalyst particle these are the catalyst particle catalyst particle catalyst particle now in a fake bed reactor, there is a pressure drop. Uh, as we have already discussed that uh, in fake bed reactor, when there is no pressure drop, then the uh, conversion will be increased. Now, in this case, uh, the, there is a pressure drop in a fake bed reactor, and the pressure changes with the with the length of the reactor. Suppose this is the length of the reactor. Suppose this is the length or z direction so this is the length of reaction and suppose the pressure at this place the pressure of the gases of the reactant or the pressure of the gas at this point is suppose it is p1 suppose the pressure of gases at this position is q2 q2 or it may be atmospheric pressure or some other pressure it can be 1 atm 1 atm or some higher pressure and this pressure usually this pressure is very high about 10 atm 20 atm or depend on the problem so the pressure changes with the the z direction uh, inside the fake bed reactor this is the fake bed reactor pbr fake bed reactor so how the pressure will change is with the z direction and how so and these are the catalyst and how the catalyst particle how the catalyst particle uh, affect the pressure drop and what is the effect of particle size or the particle diameter on the conversion of reactant uh, on the conversion of reactant o. so for these uh, for this type of problem argon proposed uh, an equation which is called the argon equation o and the mathematical form of argon equation is given below so the mathematical form of argon equation is dp by dz dp by dz is equal to minus g m21 minus porosity divided by gc which is conversion factor the density of the gas passed through the bed of reactor the bed of particle uh, this is the density and uh, uh, this is the gc this is the density and uh, this is the diameter of the particle dp and uh, uh, this is the porosity of the bed and to 150 mu which is the viscosity of the gas passes through the bed 1 minus porosity which show the volume of the solid divided by 
divided by the diameter of the particle plus dp mean the diameter of the particle plus 1.75 1.75 sorry this is the this is the 1.75 into g so dp change in pressure with the z direction suppose this is the this is the z, z direction this is the z direction these are the catalyst particle these are the catalyst particle and gases are reactant passes through the catalyst particle when the suppose this is the reaction this is the product when the gas molecule combine with the catalyst particle it will convert it into product b inside the pack bed reactor and the pressure will be drop inside the pack bed reactor and the pressure drop inside the reactor is dp by dz is equal to minus g into 1 minus porosity of the bed divided by g c into density of the air or density of the reactant gas and to uh, diameter of the catalyst particle this is the catalyst particle and this is the diameter of the catalyst particle the diameter of the catalyst particle dp and this is the porosity this is the porosity of the particle this is the porosity porosity of the bed of the bed usually the porosity of the bed is uh, 0.4 it can be it can be 40% it can be 50% it can be 55% usually in most cases it is 40% we take we assume porosity for spherical spheri per particle we assume the porosity 40% or 0.4 and this is the density this is the density of the reactant or density of the gas density of the gas and this is the porosity of the bed I, and mu is the uh, viscosity of the uh, reactant mu is the viscosity of the reactant it is nothing but viscosity it is it is the viscosity. The unit of viscosity is kilogram per meter into second. Per meter into second. Similarly, similarly, the G is nothing but it is mass flux. G is nothing but mass flux of the gas, and mass flux is nothing but mass mass per unit time and to per unit area. Mass flow rate per unit area is called mass flux or the mass of gas of gases or the mass of the reactant which pass, uh, passing in one second through this unit area is called the mass flux of the gas and it is denoted by G. So this is the mass flux. So for laminar flow if the uh, villa if the uh, flow inside the bed is small or the velocity of the gas is inside the bed is small or if the flow inside the bed is laminar then this term will be used only this is for laminar 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 flow if the flow is high or velocity of the flow or the velocity of gases or liquid is very high then and viscosity is small or if the renal, the renal number of fluid inside the bed is very high then this term will be used this is for the turbulent uh, flow this is for the this is for the turbulent flow this is for the turbulent flow inside the pack bed reactor so uh, these two are for laminar and turbulent flow now the gc term is now the GC term in the uh, organic equation is the conversion factor. The unit of GC is nothing but it is 32.174 per 
we can square LBM divided by LBF, which is nothing but a conversion factor. Or per SI system, the GC, the unit of GC is 1. That is simply 1. The unit of density, the uh, new, uh, rho is the density of gas and the unit of density is kilogram per cubic meter. The mass flux is nothing but it is G, capital G, and it is the, the it is the uh, mass flow rate per unit area, per unit area. Or G can be equal to the density of the gas passing through the fake bed reactor and to the velocity of the uh, reactant or velocity of the uh, uh, gases passing through the bed. And if we, uh, if we uh, look at the unit of uh, density, which is kilogram per cubic meter, and the unit of velocity is meter per second, so the unit of the mass flux is kilogram per second and to uh, square meter, which is nothing but mass, mass per unit time is mass flow rate and per unit area. So mass flow rate per unit area which is nothing but mass flux so viscosity of the air mu is the viscosity of viscosity of air viscosity of air or reactant reactant passing through the bed and the unit of viscosity is the unit of viscosity is nothing but it is kilogram per meter into second kilogram per meter into second so this is the unit of viscosity this is the kilogram so this is the unit of viscosity the unit of dp which is the diameter of the catalyst particle suppose this is the catalyst particle this is the diameter of the catalyst particle so diameter of the catalyst particle is in meter or centimeter so usually it is in centimeter or uh, millimeter or in millimeter or uh, and this quantity is the porosity. Porosity is show, uh, show us the wide volume, wide volume, wide volume divided by volume of the bed, volume of the bed. Suppose this is a fake bed reactor. This is the, uh, suppose this is the, this is a fake bed reactor. This is the reactant, this is the product. So, these spaces show us, these spaces, this space, this space, this space show us the porosity. These spaces, the space is the space between two catalyst particle is known as the void or porosity so this this is the so this space is also called the porosity and it and it is nothing but it is the volume of void or volume of space divided by total volume of the bed this is the total volume of the bed so it is nothing but volume of void volume divided by volume of the total bed is called the uh, porosity of the bed Usually porosity of the bed is 45% for the spherical particle or for zeolite or for spherical zeolite or spherical catalyst particle. The porosity is 45%, 40% or it can be 50 or 55%. Or. So, uh, these uh, can be obtained from the tables. Similarly, the viscosity, density are given in the various table and graphs. So this is all about the uh, uh, argon equation uh, and this is about the uh, gaseous reac uh, reaction on the solid particle. Uh, uh, thanks. If you are new to the channel, please like and uh, subscribe.